Okay, let's have a very quick revision before we move on to something new, okay? So, um, the first one we learned is about um, or, okay? When you see the word or, that means you have to add them up, okay? And then the second one, whenever you see the word in, okay? That means you have to multiply, okay? And then when you have to arrange, okay? A group of data, that means you have to use factorial, okay? Or, if you need to select okay some data from a group of data and also you have to arrange it in order then you use the NPR and, okay and then for the more advanced level questions okay there are usually some restrictions okay for example okay a particular datum maybe have a special requirements or okay uh, two data okay needs to separate or need to be together Okay, so let's try to do some of the examples. So for the first one, you have to arrange three digit number from three data. So since, okay, you don't have to select anything, okay, you just pick it up. So it would be using uh, pawn number three, okay. 淨是需要排啫,你不需要再抽,因為它已經得三個data嘅. So you only have to use, okay, uh, factorial. And then, okay, uh, for the second one, okay, you have to arrange three digit number from, okay, six data, okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, six data, which means that you have to use, okay, pawn number four. And also, okay, since it is a three digit number and it involves, okay, zero, you can't use zero as the hundred digit, okay? 零是不可以做八位数的,如果不是它就不是一个八位了,OK?它只是一个,如果它是零一二这样呢,它只是得十二的,它不是一个three-digit number来的。So in this case, there is some restriction. Okay, so um, to do these questions, you have to separate the cases, okay? So um, you have to consider the first digit, that means the hundred digit, okay? Uh, there are only five choices, one, two, three, four, five, okay? And then for the rest, that means the 10 digit and also the unit digit, then you can choose zero, okay? So which will give you, okay, the answer should be, okay, the first one, that means uh, out of one, two, three, four, five, five choices, you can select any number, okay, uh, to be the hundred digit, okay, so this part would be this part, okay, and then for the remaining two, for example, if I choose one as the first digit, okay, that means, okay, in the second and the third option, I can't choose one anymore. So in this case, okay, originally you should minus one options, okay, 本身呢,你如果八位揀咗一個話呢,咁你嘅十位同個位唔可以再揀一,你本身係應該少一個嘅data嘅。但是好巧的,它有多一個零,因為你八位不可以揀,但是你十位和個位又可以揀,你少了一個choices,但是你又多一個choices,在這樣的情況之下,就沒有變,仍然是五個choices。So here would be five choices, you have to select two numbers out for the ten digit and also the unit digit. OK,那麼我選擇做十位和個位。OK,在這個情況之下,你看到我是用成的,原因就是因為我要選,我要選是要一加二,我要選了三個數字出來,我才做到一個three-digit number的。即是代表它不是是但一個發生就可以,它是要選完八位再選十位和個位,是要這樣順著發生,它才會選到three-digit number,所以我們就是用成了。另外,其實還有第二個想法的。這個方法就是首先我想想究竟最煩是誰其實這裡的這條題目,其實它只有一個限制,就是八位是不可以是0。其實只有這個restriction,其實它沒有其他restriction的。如果是這樣的話,我就先解決了這個問題。OK,剛才說過,這個八位不可以是零,即是一二三四五是但一個數字。
。OK， 十位同個位又唔揀嘅。如果揀咗一個話，淨係唔可以揀一隻。如果我揀咗二，唔可以揀二。揀咗三唔準揀三。咁但係其餘嗰五個 choices 咧係可以照揀，而且係冇任何限制嘅。咁所以呢。嗰、那個剩翻落嚟咧 ，OK 嘅可能性咧就會係五 P 二、五 P 二、五 P 二、五 P 二、五 P 二 ，OK。咁然之後咧，由於咧佢哋咧係五個獨立嘅 cases 嚟嘅 ，OK。咁所以咧，我咧就將佢哋咧係全部用加。咁咪即係五 P 二加五 P 二加五 P 二加五 P 二加五 P 二咯。咁你計出嚟嘅答案呢，亦都係一樣嘅，只不過係個諗法有少少唔同就係、是、我呢個位都用 P， 定還是係唔係嘅？我呢個位呢，選擇係 list out 佢。咁然後呢，淨係去到呢啲唔需要 restriction 嘅地方呢，我先至用 P。OK， 咁其實都可以計到答案嘅。咁我希望呢，你對於呢，即係如果係有 restriction 嘅喺。specific 某一個位咧，你可以解決到呢個問題啦。咁咁另外咧就係 B 嗰度啦。咁 B 嗰度咧就係講話咧，如果阿 A 同阿 B 咧一定要分開嘅話咧，咁唔可以坐埋一齊嘅話咧，咁個技巧咧，你記住咧就係先安排曬啲咧其他人先，即係可能阿 C 啊、D 啊、阿 E 啊、阿 F 啊，你可以安排咗佢哋嘅坐位先。然之後咧，先至諗下咧，有乜嘢空位咧可以俾咧阿 A 同阿 B 攝入去。咁你發現咧，呢度係有一個空位啦，兩個空位啦，三個空位啦，四個同埋五個。喺五個空位裏面俾安排兩個學生坐。咁其實咧，你就可以 KO 咗 Part B 噶啦。咁、那個 skills 咧就大致係咁樣。咁啊，跟住呢，就去到最尾呢 c 嗰度呢，就係 A 同 B 一定要坐埋一齊啦。咁咁如果呢 A 同 B 要坐埋一齊嘅話呢，你就可以呢將 A、B 啦就 group 埋一齊先。咁然之後呢 c 啦、D 啦、E 啦、F 啦，你就當佢呢係一個獨立嘅。個體，因為佢哋冇任何 restriction 啊嘛。OK， 咁你呢就當咧呢度呢係有五嚿嘢。OK， 一。二三四五，呢五嚿嘢佢哋先調一調位。OK， 然之後咧 ，A 同 B 呢兩個人咧都可以交換嘅，可以 A B 或者 B A 嘅。咁所以咧，要成多一個呢、这個。OK， 咁嚟嚟去去咧，大致上其實都係呢三款題目比較常見啲，咁你可以做多少少呢啲題目啦。OK。